Now in this class, we will learn how to insert page break into our LibreOffice Writer document. Usually sometimes we need to change the formatting or the styling of our page from maybe portrait to landscape or the about. But in each case, we have to insert a page break so that we can assign that or do that those kind of changes. So let's say at this document, I want to, on my own, uh, start the next page from this point, from this point that I want. I want this to be on a fresh page and to continue from there. So all I need is to be on that page or at that point where I want to create the breakout. So I can just come to insert and see page break over here. We can get to that by using the command enter to get to the same page break. So once I hit on page break, you can see it has captured those contents to the next page. It has quickly moved the content to the next page and you can see it has created this small break sign. Okay, indicating that this page is no more the same as the other page. So I have now more control as regards changing the properties of this page. So for example, this is portrait. I want to make this page landscape. Okay, so I can just right click here and come to page style. And over here, this is the style is the default page style, but I want to make it landscape. So I can see I just made it landscape. Once I hit on apply, this is going to convert my page to be a landscape page. So you can see okay to this. And I will have this page from this page downwards continuously to the end of the document as landscape. Now, if I don't want it to be continuous to the end of the document, maybe I want after this page for the document to go back to portrait, I can just come over here and from this page, I'll still insert another page break. So you can see right now I've inserted another page break, which means I now have the power to change whatever I want on this one. So let's say I want to go to page style and then change it to landscape this time around as well. Okay, so you can see landscape and I can apply this to this page as well. Or I can take it back to portrait, which is the default page style. And you can see apply to this and you can see okay to this. And now this now becomes my a portrait from this. Okay, so subsequently, if I have any interest, also I can right click and go over here and say convert this to portrait, which is the default uh, page style. And I can say okay, apply this and okay. Okay, default page, apply this on this page. Okay, so I can still create another page break over here. All right, insert another page break. And then I can still have the control now to change this to portrait or however I want it. All right, so let's go to the default and apply this. Okay, and you can see default and now apply. And you can now say okay to this and you can see right now everything is now back to the normal one okay so this is basically how to edit pages you can have more other controls if you want by still coming to insert pages and you can see how more breaks you can insert manual row breaks or column breaks or you can do manual breaks directly so you can specify the line break if it is a line break you can specify which line in the document uh, restart location you can specify is it a column break or page break or you can can be very specific using this feature as well. Okay, so this concludes this class about inserting and managing page breaks within LibreOffice. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.